Like the math is really clear. We're, it's like a bank account where you're taking out more than you're putting in. When it comes to water use. Yeah, the Colorado River is in a crisis. We're not living within our means. We are va using vastly more water than the river can provide. A significant portion of Denver's water comes from Lake Dillon. Bart Miller with Western Resource Advocates says it's normal around this time of year to see water levels drop. Reservoirs around Colorado are pretty low. Uh, Blue Mesa Reservoir, which is down by the town of Gunnison, is, is quite low. Around Blue Mesa, water has been released in the past to help fill Lake Powell. And while reservoirs here in Colorado are struggling, that's nothing compared to the compounding effects of drought farther south by Lake Mead and Lake Powell. If we don't take action in the short term, literally in the next year, those reservoirs, Lake Powell and Lake Mead, will continue to drop. And the concern is that they'll get down to critical levels. Critical levels at Lake Mead and Lake Powell would mean they're not able to generate hydropower or deliver water farther downstream. Miller says it's an urgent situation, and the Bureau of Reclamation's commissioner asked River Basin states to come up with a plan to cut two to four million acre feet of water by mid-August. Yesterday's deadline came and went without much by way of a commitment. The upper basin states had a plan with a few elements uh, which were fairly modest, and the lower basin did not have a plan at all. He says the upper basin states, Colorado, New Mexico, Utah, and Wyoming, suggest reauthorizing a pilot program from eight years ago that pays people like farmers to use less water, among other things. The notion of reauthorizing it is a good idea, but that program would need to expand probably about tenfold to be able to get um, a lot of the, the potential reductions. Miller says the upper basin state's plan is a good first step, but it's not enough. I'm concerned, but there's still time to fix this. I think we really have to think about accelerating the scale at which we do conservation all across the basin. Miller says Arizona is being asked to cut about 20% of their water use starting in 2023. Nevada and the country of, New Me or of Mexico will also have to make water reductions, but on a smaller scale. If you're wondering, you do have a voice in this. The Colorado, Colorado Water Plan is currently in its public feedback stage. They're taking comments on the Colorado Water Conservation Board's website. We'll link that to uh, this story on 9news.com. Yeah, it's very important. Hopefully people uh, care enough to weigh in and try to help get this solved because it's, it's a mess that's coming our way. You know, they're saying Lake Mead and Lake Powell, they're at about quarter capacity right now, so it really can't go much lower than that. And Bart is telling us that all of those basin states, all seven of them, are going to have to work together collaboratively to come up with a solution here. Yeah, all I think right. the visual, too, people getting to see those lakes as low as they are, uh, certainly striking a chord. All right, Courtney, thanks.